Bartholin's cyst abscesses can be treated by two methods. Word catheter placement is the first-line therapy for an infected Bartholin's gland. If infections recur or if word catheter placement is not curative, then marsupialization of the gland is the most definitive therapy. The equipment required for the word catheter placement includes an 11-blade scalpel, a hemostat, 5 cc's of sterile water and a word catheter, along with 10 cc's of lidocaine and bupivacaine, local anesthetic, in a one-to-one -one mixture. Place the patient in the lithotomy position and cleanse the perineum with antiseptic solution. Palpate the cyst to clearly visualize its size and location. Place a block over a 2 cm diameter area over the vaginal sidewall that overlies the surface of the cyst. If local cellulitis and induration are present, a small field block may provide optimal anesthesia. Incise the vaginal sidewall with a 3 mm incision using the 11 blade through the mucosal layers and into the cyst. Remove the blade and use a small hemostat to enter the cyst and hold the incision open to allow the contents to drain. Test the word catheter balloon by filling the catheter with 3 cc's of sterile water then allowing the syringe to refill and collapse the word catheter balloon. With the balloon deflated and the catheter attached to the syringe, insert the tip of the catheter into the cyst cavity. Holding the incision open with a hemostat can aid in proper placement of the catheter. It is possible to place the catheter between the mucosal layer and the cyst if the insertion is not done correctly, which will not properly drain the cyst. Inflate the balloon with 3 cc's of sterile water and remove the needle from the base of the catheter. The catheter should stay in place and be comfortably filling the cyst cavity. Be sure not to overfill the balloon and create high tissue tension around the cyst, as this would cause significant patient discomfort after the anesthetic wears off. Push the catheter back up into the vagina and provide the patient with clear post-operative care instructions and ensure proper healing of the tract created by the word catheter. The catheter is ideally removed at three weeks by simply deflating the balloon and removing the catheter.